Good morning, Huskies. Happy Monday. This week for instruction, I am going to teach you different ways to do planks. If you've checked our webpage, Monday's challenge in our daily challenge calendar is how long can you hold a plank? So I'm going to teach you different ways to hold the plank and you can decide which one's best for you, which one's easiest, and let us know how long you can hold that plank. One idea for a plank is a high plank. A high plank is done by having straight arms, your hands are on the ground, your back is flat, your bottom is down, not up, your bottom is down and your legs are straight. You need to think about it like this. If your friend put a glass of water on your back, can you hold it or will it tip over? If it tips over, it means that you are not completely flat. So right now, depending on where my friend put that glass of water, it might tip. So if I raised a little bit up, notice how everything's still in a straight line, back, bottom, and legs, and I'd be able to hold that glass of water. The second idea is a low plank. This one is done on your elbows. So your elbows are now on the ground and you are holding that plank just like that. The same rules apply. Everything is flat. A glass of water should be able to stay there. The next one is a side plank. Now that can be done with a straight arm like this. Notice now my side, my hip, my legs are completely flat and straight. Or you can go on your elbow. Whichever way is easiest for you. Your, non, your hand that you're not using can be out to your side, up in the air, whichever works best for you. Now, if you want a real challenge, you can do something where you alternate taps or you lift and hold. And alternating taps, I'm gonna do shoulder taps. Start in a high plank position. Again, everything is flat and ready to go. You're just simply going to lift your right hand touch your left shoulder. Then lift your left hand, touch your right shoulder. Notice I move a little bit. The goal is to not move at all. Now that's going to be pretty difficult unless you have really good balance and really good core muscles, but that's the goal when you do alternating taps. Go nice and slow so you do the exercise correctly. The other concept could be lifting hands lifting legs. Now, you can do that with just hands to start off with, just like that. Or, if you really wanted to, you can get in the plank position, so everything straight, lift a leg, lift the other leg. Now again, that's going to work really well if you have solid core muscles. So don't feel discouraged if you can't do that very well. You'll notice this next one, I'm not very good at it either because I don't have great balance. The last one that I'm going to teach you today, this is another alternating plank and this is where you're going to lift your right hand and your left leg. Check this out. Everything's straight. Make sure everything is straight before you begin and then you lift and put down. Lift and put down. Again, you are trying to stay balanced. There's no way that glass would have stayed on my back. That definitely would have tipped over and fallen. Also, if you do decide to attempt the glass challenge, my advice to you would be use a plastic glass. We don't need to break any glass while we attempt this. All right, so now I've decided I'm just going to hold a high plank for as long as I possibly can. Let's see how this goes. Ready? Go. If you want to do it along with me, go ahead, boys and girls. You can do the low plank, the side plank. You can do the more difficult ones and try the shoulder taps, attempt the alternating lifts, whatever you want to do. This instructional video really tuckered out my abdominals and my lower back muscles. This is not going to go well.
Have I been going for five minutes, boys and girls? I'm just kidding. I'm gonna be lucky if I make a minute. I'm starting to wobble. Always remember, boys and girls, when you're doing any exercises to breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth. Oh. Oh, man. I'm done. I'm out. Your body is going to let you know when it's time to give up. So listen to your body. Well, there's Monday's daily challenge, the planks. I probably lasted about 40 seconds, maybe. Let's see if anybody can beat Mr. D. Have a great and a safe day, guys. Bye-bye.